going on guys? Adam Brown Adventures here. Thanks for joining me on another scuba diving adventure. Today I'm at a river in Georgia that I'm gonna be checking out. I've been here before and found some really cool things. I think I found like a tablet or like some type of phones out here before. I also found part of a shotgun here before and I know my buddies have found some crazy things too. So we're about to get geared up, get in that water. We've got a few hours, hopefully can find some treasures today. So I have all my gear here. I have my scuba tank. It's gonna allow me to stay underwater for like two hours if I can breathe well. And I got my full face mask from OTS today with my Orca Torch dive light and my GoPro there. So I got the whole setup, got my treasure bag. Probably need to get another one of these because it does have a hole in it, but that'll help me out for now. This is my, this is my other little treasure bag for my best treasures. So let's get the gear on real quick, get in that water. Oh yeah. Thanks for joining me on another scuba diving adventure, guys. Today I am at a spot I've only been to a handful of times, but you know, there's always treasures to be found in every location, in every body of water. So right off the bat, I find like a bottle, and I'm really not sure what this thing is. It looks like a weight, maybe? And I keep diving around and I find a giant tire. I always find tires when I'm going diving. I don't know how they all get there, but they are definitely plenty of tires. <laughs> I also find tons of bottles. A lot of times they're old Coke bottles. This is like a Pepsi Cola bottle. I think it's a little bit more modern though. So this was kind of convenient because the current was a little bit strong actually. Conditions were not great so I found this little rope and it kind of helped me get up past a little spot so that's always nice. <laughs> Another very common item that I find while scuba diving is shoes. People lose them all the time. I also found a couple of glasses. I think these are like wine glasses. And I found another one that matched here. So that's kind of funny. So I'm not exactly sure what this thing is. It looks like a pipe fitting or something off some type of hose. And this is kind of interesting. Check this thing out. I found a lucky clover necklace. So I kept diving. I popped up for a second to check this out. I don't find a lot of jewelry. Oh, this is costume jewelry. It still counts. <laughs> And I'm still not exactly sure what this thing is. If you guys know, leave a comment. Is it a pillow maybe? I don't know. This was definitely weird. So I pop up here, take a look at it, and it was pretty full of dirt. The seal was tight too, so I'll, I'm thinking there's something in here, so I'm dumping it out, trying to make sure if there is something, I don't lose it. So, I didn't see anything, but it was definitely mysterious. Oh yeah, finding sunglasses. So I did find a vape pen here and I'm collecting all the garbage I can. I have a trash bag. Thankfully there wasn't actually that much in this spot. And I found a car mirror. So if you guys know what this goes off, what type of car this goes on to, leave a comment. Oh, 
and I found a mystery piece of metal. We come across these a lot, and uh, it's, sometimes it's hard to identify metal when it's just a piece of scrap. But I think it might have been off like a car or a shopping cart, or like a, a go kart or something. <laughs> I thought this was a bracelet, but I think it's some fishing weights. There wasn't a lot of fishing stuff in this location, but I do pretty often come across it. Can we just take a moment to uh, appreciate the beauty of the trees changing? <laughs> Whenever I rewatch the footage of these, sometimes I don't really realize it while I'm there, and then I look back and it's just gorgeous outside. She's gorgeous! <laughs> and so I came across this pocket of bullets, and I just kept finding them in these cracks in the crevices. So I'm trying to steer all the silt away to see what else is hidden in there. So I'm just finding a handful of these bullets. I'm not exactly sure of the gap, the caliber. But that's pretty cool. So I came across another old bottle. I believe this is a Pepsi bottle. This one actually is a little older, it looks like. And what is this thing, guys? And I got an old Coca-Cola bottle and a little glass. And I also found like these old tokens that we find very often in this area. And this was pretty nasty. I think it's like a bottle of lotion. And I got the remains of what used to be some type of fishing pole. Another like, it looks like it came off a pipe, but this is like a big sort of pipe fitting or junction. I found an old brick here and then actually found somebody's key. I don't know if that's her house key, but that's never fun to lose a key. And some random metal rebar scrap. 
and this was like a pile of spark plugs that were like permanently stuck to the rocks. <laughs> I don't know how that happens, but that was weird. And then I found a cute little net. Look at this thing, guys. <laughs> And this might have been one of the weirder things I found today, for sure. I found a pot, but check out what was inside of this thing. Yeah. That's golf ball. You caught it. I feel like that's every time. Oh yeah. All right, guys, just got out of the water. I was struggling a little bit today, guys. I'm not going to lie. The current was a little rougher than normal, a little bit high, and I was clinging on the rocks and trying my best. And I did find a few cool things, as you guys saw. Didn't find any banger items, but some weird things. Let's go over everything I found. Usually, I like to have a whole truck bed full of treasure. But, hey, I'll settle for what I got. Still got a few items. I got uh, this Coke bottle here. That's nice. Got one pair of sunglasses. And a golf ball. I got well, three golf balls. And I found this uh, lucky necklace. I, I was hoping it was going to give me some good luck and find something crazy. But uh, hey, I still cleaned up some trash. What type of tool is this? Do you guys know? Is it like a trowel or something? I'm not sure. Kind of looked like a metal detector when I found it. Found a part of some pipe here. Did get a little vape pen, so that was cool. And I found this cute little net. Look at that bad boy. Woo! Might be able to catch me a marlin with that. What do you guys think? found a little uh, jar here and this was kind of interesting this old wrench found if you guys can tell that used to be a key found some bullets I'm not sure what type of ammo that is can't really read it so if you guys know leave a comment let me know what caliber those are and this was kind of interesting an old aspirin container <laughs> so telling how old that thing is bear but hey check it out guys I found a pot and what's weird about this pot is, look inside, dude. Do you see that? There's a knife in there. So I'm not sure what was cooking <laughs> when they lost this, but it smells terrible. I'll tell you guys that much. So, still glad I can clean up some trash. Didn't get anything insane, but I hope you guys still enjoyed coming along on this adventure. So, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Also, if you want to stay updated whenever I post a video, hit that notification bell below. Also, you know, if you want to check me out on TikTok, Instagram, follow me on Facebook, all the goodies, all the places. I would really appreciate it. And you know, I do this every week, making awesome content, exploring, finding cool treasures for you guys. So if you enjoy this content, you're definitely not gonna wanna miss out on what I have coming up in the future. So stay tuned. So until then guys, I will see y'all on the next adventure. Oh yeah. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you want to help support me and what I do every week, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next adventure. Oh yeah.